students celebrating the first synthetic turf in a Srinagar school. AstroTurf set up by Woodland House School for budding footballers. And in a city which has almost no nightlife, the ground is equipped for night matches as well. The school says the field is open to all. The whole point of sport is to make it fun. In fact, we did a tournament last week where we had almost about 16 to 18 teams participate. We had music on while it was playing. So the whole idea is to make it more than a serious sport. Of course, that comes with it. More recreation and more fun for the youth to look forward to. The opening ceremony wasn't fun just for the children, but also for politicians. Former Chief Minister Omar Abdullah and his colleague Nasir Sogami stumbled at first, but quickly recovered to join the fun. Top government officials hope this will be a trendsetter. This is the first of the first of the kind in the private sector and I think it is going to be a trendsetter and I'm sure that many more people will come forward and create such facilities. I think it's wonderful that such a facility. Education and sports have been the biggest casualties of the conflict in Kashmir for the last three decades. This year schools opened in March after remaining shut for almost three years. First due to the prolonged curfew and restrictions after revocation of Article 370 and later due to Covid. In a football crazy place, this is the first school which has come up with an Esther turf. On the first day, politicians who have been pushed to margins for the last four years also had some fun. They played, fell and got up again. In Srinagar, Nazir Masudi for NDTV.